TI-715b is a newly discovered super-Earth planet that orbits a red dwarf star in its habitable zone, only 137 light-years away from Earth. This planet is one of the most promising candidates for further study, as it could reveal clues about the potential for life on other worlds. You are watching Luminary Cosmos. In this video, we will deep dive into the newly found planet, TOI-715b, to ponder the question, what if? Humans can live on this exoplanet. So watch this video till the end and don't forget to subscribe. The planet was detected by NASA's Transiting Exoplanet Survey Satellite, TESS, which observes the slight dimming of starlight when a planet passes in front of its star. The planet was confirmed by follow-up observations from ground-based telescopes, such as the Subaru Telescope in Hawaii. The researchers also found evidence of a second, smaller planet in the same system, which could also be in the habitable zone. TOI-715b is about 1.5 times the size of Earth and has a mass of about 3.02 times that of Earth. It orbits its star once every 19 days, at a distance that allows liquid water to exist on the surface of a rocky planet, assuming it has a suitable atmosphere. The planet's orbit is nearly circular, meaning it does not experience significant variations in temperature or radiation throughout its year. However, the planet is likely tidally locked to its star, meaning it always shows the same face to the star, creating a permanent day and night side. The planet's parent star, TOI-715, is a relatively quiet and stable red dwarf, unlike some of its more active and flare-prone counterparts. This could be beneficial for the planet's habitability, as it reduces the chances of atmospheric erosion and radiation damage. Red dwarfs are the most common type of star in the galaxy and are known to host many small, rocky planets, some of which could be habitable. The planet's atmosphere is the key to determining its potential for life. If the planet has a thick atmosphere, it could moderate the temperature differences between the day and night sides and provide protection from stellar radiation. If the atmosphere has water vapor, carbon dioxide, or other greenhouse gases, it could also create a warm and humid climate on the planet. The planet's atmosphere could also contain biosignatures, such as oxygen, ozone, methane, or nitrous oxide, that could indicate the presence of life. However, these gases could also have non-biological sources, such as volcanic activity, photochemistry, or geochemistry, so they would need to be confirmed by other measurements. The planet is a prime target for future observations by the James Webb Space Telescope, which will be able to study the planet's atmosphere in infrared wavelengths and detect the spectral signatures of various molecules. The telescope will also be able to measure the planet's temperature, albedo, and cloud cover, and possibly even map its surface features. TI-715b is one of the few super-Earths that have been detected in the habitable zone of a red dwarf star. Most of the known habitable zone planets around red dwarfs are Earth-sized or smaller, such as Proxima b, Trappist-1e, and LHS-1140b. The discovery of TOI-715b and its possible companion is a significant milestone for the field of exoplanet science, as it demonstrates the ability of TESS and other telescopes to find small, potentially habitable planets around nearby stars. These planets are the best targets for future missions that aim to characterize their atmospheres and search for signs of life. TOI-715b is one of the first super-Earths found in the habitable zone of a red dwarf, and it could be a key to unlocking the secrets of this fascinating class of planets. So viewers, that's all for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this video and learned something new. If you did, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more this kind of content. And don't forget to leave a comment below and share this video with your friends. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.